So, Coach, talking about, about this match preparation, obviously you hadn't played on North Greenville before. What type of challenges does that present going into a match like this? It's kind of tough. You kind of just, based off of the limited amount of film that you have on the other team, kind of go with that. Um, if not, you kind of just trying to establish yourself with your own team, trying to just do your own game, play your own style. Now, Adam, this is really your second year in the starting setter position. What's been the biggest adjustment, or how do you feel that you've grown the most since last season? Um, since last season, well, I had shoulder surgery in May, um, so this fall um, season was a lot of me just getting back to where I was. But yeah, just always getting stronger, trying to jump higher, put on some weight. I'm a skinny guy, so I'm trying to be have more endurance about the match. And Sam, talking about you, obviously, big freshman year. For you coming into this sophomore season, I want to ask, you know, what were the expectations for, for you, personally? Uh, I don't really have much expectations for myself, but going into it, and then as we went throughout the year uh, with the new head coach, things were pretty different, and I started to just get higher and higher expectations as the year went on. Yeah. Johnny, I want to ask you about the match here that, that just took place. Obviously, offensively, you guys really seem to be clicking defensively. What were you guys seeing out on the court that allowed you to have so much success? Well, I think most of it just had to do with all of our talking. I mean, me, Ryan, and Nate in the back row were constantly talking, like, where the hitters were going to hit, where the ball was coming, what team we had, and that really made it easy, knowing that two seniors back there really helped me communicate and then bring it all together. And Coach, I want to ask you, you know, last season, obviously, not the best start in the world. Yeah, I think, you know, had a couple losses, but you really seemed to come on strong towards the end of the season. And this year, you know, you're clicking. What does that say about the team and the players that, you know, they really, you know, they didn't collapse on themselves midway through last season? Yeah, you know, they came back with a little bit of a chip on their shoulder, one with proving themselves in the conference. And, you know, the seniors and the juniors are kind of wanting to get things going, get the program going in the right direction. We didn't want it to take, you know, a certain number of games to get going. So it was good to, to get a couple wins right now, and we're excited to get ready to play for it tomorrow. Yeah. All right, a couple more questions before we wrap up here. So I have to ask, who got the slice of pizza and what do you guys think about it? <laughs> no, I haven't, haven't gotten into it yet. Still locked yeah. in. Yep. They're probably eating it. All right. yeah, it's probably gone by now. So. All right. oh, so you guys will get some. We'll yeah, get so. some. Adam, I do want to ask you, because one of the interesting things when I look online, you know, everyone's in a tie, you're in a bow tie. So I got to ask, do you consider yourself the most stylish person in the, NC oh. in the NCAA? <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Obviously. Yeah. Check out my Instagram. <laughs> <laughs> no, that was inspired by Joe. Joe always wore bow ties when he was just so I was like, I should wear a bow tie every future. <laughs> awesome. Well, one final question. We'll let you guys go on this. Uh, Coach, obviously, you have Barton coming up um, tomorrow. What do you guys have to do to be successful against them? we got to control a certain pass game and establish the middle of the court. If we can do those things, that's going to lead to a lot of success for us. All right. Well, those are all the questions from the media. Uh, actually, we'll open it up here for one or two questions from any of the fans or parents that are in. If you guys want to ask one or two questions. Where's the bow tie today? It's, it's an early early afternoon game. Both ties are going to be for the primetime games. I'll make sure to wear it next time. All right, I think, think we got time for one more if anyone has a question else that they want to ask. All right, we'll, we'll wrap on that. Well, guys, thank you so much for joining us today. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate it.